Hello everybody, welcome back to my video. So I'm here today to film my life journal flipthrough of this chunky baby. Um, this journal is from Michaels. I just got it from like the, the journal section. It's just a regular blank sketchbook with um, blank pages, obviously. And it got pretty chunky. So this journal was from March 25th through May 19th. So. It lasted a good while. Um, here is my new journal. I filmed a video for my life journal setup, so I'll leave that up above and down below. So you guys can go check that out. But here today to finally film this flip through. Well, not finally, I literally just filmed the video yesterday for my life journal setup. But yep, I'm here today to film this flip through. So let's just get into it because I'm very excited to show you guys what I did in this journal. Okay, so when you open it up, you obviously have the cover page and a quote. How you love yourself is how you teach others to love yourself. Ruby Core quote. And then, so 2023 Life Journal started March 25th, completed May 19th. Today my heart is filled with joy. I see the positive in everything today. So, yep, that's my cover page. And then, moving on to my 2023 goals. So... I basically just have some goals. This is from my cousin's wedding, raise my grades, I did that. Trip to Mexico, that's in my next journal, so. Yep, and then here's a little update. So I did this on March 25th, 2023 update. So I just did a little update. March title page, so this is for 2023, obviously. This is on March 25th, so that same day. This is when I got the journal and, yep, a receipt, blank page, 80 sheets. It honestly felt longer than that, but yeah. And then I was watching the Trench Family a lot, so I decided to do a fun little spread to document that. So I, this is just a simple page. And then I wrote down some thoughts, so write what's on your mind, and then I did some fun little doodles. And then more writing. And then I tried Crumble Cookie for the first time. Where is the date at? I have no idea, but I did try crumble cookie for the first time, so I just did a fun little spread to document that. And yeah, loved it by the way. And then this is some spring aesthetics, so I just did this fun little layering spread. Love how this spread turned out. This is probably one of my favorite spreads that I did in this journal this year. So let's see what this is about. And then it, this is on March 28th. We, it was a lazy day, and then I don't know where this receipt is from, but it's from somewhere, I don't know. Maybe from like Jersey Mix Up or something. But um, today was a really amazing day. Yup, 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 Exactly. And then some secrets in here. Okay, we're not gonna open that because that's personal, so we're gonna move on. And then I got some new washi tapes on the 29th of March, so I got like this stunning washi tape of a bunch of women, this memories washi tape, this blue washi tape with different colored polka dots, this red washi tape, this washi tape with a bunch of lips on it, that same washi tape from this one, and this plain green washi tape, and then this fun little washi tape with a bunch of objects, and I wrote, Woo, got more washi tapes. Do I need more? No. Um, this was also when we were visiting LA, so I got some new table decor. March memories, so this is some March memories from March. This is when I got Chain of Thorns, haven't finished that book yet, which is really crazy, because I um, obviously hate that book, but I DNF'd it, so yeah. This is on March 31st as well, so we went to Redlands, this kiss on the napkin, I don't know, my sister did that, I think. Some tags from a bunch of different places, Starbucks, got a haircut. Oh, I need to get another haircut, actually, because my hair is really long. Then this is a tag from a swamp meet that we went to. Chain of Thorns update, I was really loving that at the beginning, but then I obviously hated it towards the end. And then here's a fun little pocket I made. Moving on to April, so this is just my fun little title page for April. I love this title page a lot. 
I don't know how I'm going to show you, but I love this title page a lot. It's probably one of my favorite title pages. And then I just wrote a little entry inside this. And look. Wow, I love this. Exactly. Okay, so now we're moving on to the Rose Garden spread. So, we went to an aquarium. And I obviously just did a fun little spread here. I opened this and then I wrote a little entry. This was on the 1st of April. And then the next spread, this was also on the 1st of April. So this is more about the museum and all this stuff. And then on April 3rd, I also just one thing, I don't think I journaled that much in April too. So yep, April 3rd, I got some new stationery. So I got these fun little notepads. Got these new notepads, and then on April 7th, we went to Book Off, and yep, got some Jersey Mike subs as well. And in here, I think I wrote like a, this is like the receipt from that day. And then this is just one year that we got, one year ago today, one year ago on April 7th, we got the keys. So I just did this fun little spread to document it. And then I did this fun spread on April 8th. So we went to Shakey's, my, the ham, my our ginkgo needed surgery. So yep, this was just kind of a sad page to do, but. And then here, I usually never do drawing in my journal, but I decided, you know what, let's just splurge a little bit and we'll do some drawing. And then I did a spread for Lunge and Born because I was reading that rating so far four stars. And then this was a little, little life update. So here I just wrote a little entry under there, but I literally did not have time to write anything. I'm grateful for my friends. Put a little entry under here. Yep. Some more layering, more layering. Love these spreads, like I said. And then I was watching a lot of Catherine Karras, so this spread was kind of inspired by her aesthetics, so. I just did this fun page, and I just added a fun little quote, reach for the stars. Some more aesthetic pages. I never finished this page because I guess I didn't have time, and I also didn't have time either, so. I didn't have time. I didn't feel like finishing it. And then I did this spread literally just yesterday because um, I think I just left this page blank and then I was gonna do something on it, but then I forgot, so. I just kind of just did some random stuff. Um, yep, yep, yep. Some more layering. Hate how this page turned out. Definitely one of my least favorite pages, but you just need to embrace it. And then another one of my favorite pages. Not this one. I hate that one. But yep, here is one of my other second favorite spreads. And then this was on April 15th. So we went to Starbucks. We went to Target, and yeah, love this pink tissue tape paper. I wonder where my mom got it from, but don't know. Then we took an evening hike. Thank you, mean lady. <laughs> I remember that. That was funny. Love that day. April 18th. I think I filmed a YouTube short for this. Maybe I took it down. And then this is when I started stationing with Max on the 18th of April, so love that. For me um so i started this youtube on the 18th of april wow it marked a month that i started this youtube channel a month in two days um wow and then yep basically just did a fun little spread to document me starting station with max thank you guys so much for almost 40 subscribers and then april 21st a random update april memories so i just did a lot of april memories so like a random handout from the museum Cooking, delicious homemade cookies, favorite creative days, lots of silly days, handout, journaling, productive days, and then some more talking to friends, rose garden, vintage finds, beautiful sunny days, making pancakes. Saturday fun day, so I did this fun little spread. It was 84 degrees that day, which is scorching hot. Why is it hot in April? Don't know why. It's probably spring that way. Playlist, I don't know, I wrote Favorite Crime and Dark Academia Music. Another quote, the greatest truth of the simplest. Some more layering. This 
Brad was giving me a hard time. And this is some recent tic-tac-toe games, so with my friend. So I just stuck that in here. This was some random memories. And then this is my, from my friend Haley, so, yep. April 24th, we can cover that. And then, yeah, yep, yep. I love this spread so much. And then I s finally started reading Fruits Basket. I finished that book, so you'll see a spread that I filmed later on. Some random memories. Some more recent tic-tac-toe tic games, so. Here, I think I just have some more tic-tac-toe games that I played with my friend. And then, I don't know, I, once again, I did this by like a month later, so I just wrote, hey, it's a month later when I did this spread, so it was May. Okay, I don't remember what I was supposed to do with this, but... Okay, this is when I went to Redondo Beach because we were in LA, so we decided to take a little walk, and this was the little ticket that I got from there. And then, uh, Dee Dee's Discats. I guess we went to Dee Dee's that day. More Dee Dee's receipts. Some more random memories. Once again, another blank page that I meant to do something on, but never got around to it. Okay, so here's my fruits basket spread that I found the journal with me for, so... Um, I'll hopefully leave that down below and linked in my description. I also filmed a journal with me for starting stage champ max, so you guys can go check that out as well. Okay, so now moving on to May. So here's my fun little May title page. So very simple, obviously. Then a random print. State testing. Yep, I was doing state testing and I was very not happy about that. So we're moving on. Now it's over now. And then I did this quote, don't worry, God is always on time. And then books to read. I think I did this in, I did this spread in a vlog, so you guys can go check out that vlog as well. And then I did this random spread for the Hunger Games. I don't know, I just felt like writing down some quotes. And then some more quotes. Love this spread. Some random memories from May the 4th, be with you. And then I filmed a journal for this page, so vacation plans. Hit 30 subscribers on Station with Max, so thank you guys so great. Not thank you guys so much, so thank you y'all so much. Never thought I would be able to. YouTube ideas. We went to Shakey's once again on May 6th, so I just wrote a little entry. And then some quotes. Don't worry, God is always on time. I have nature and po art and poetry. If that is not enough, what's enough? Then state testing, I'm nervous. Ew. Yep. The greatest truths are the simplest. Once again, one of my favorite quotes. We went to Dollar, we went to Dollar Tree, so I just did this fun little spread to document that. This was on May 7th. Then a little entry on state testing, and this is from state testing as well, Jungle Crackers. And then this was from state testing, like I said. Home updates, and then some more random home updates here. This is from my friend, so I drew a picture of a donkey, a random sticky note, some dum-dums. Yup. Then I got a, this keyboard organizer, which is this, so yep. So I decided to document this. Where is the date? May 10th. So I did this one on May 10th. This got really messy because of this. I guess it kind of smudged. Then this was, I don't know what day this was, but I think I wrote a little entry in here. And then I wrote, I hate school. Who am I, a nerd? Do I look like a nerd to you? No. Then wrote some more quotes, and some more quotes. Be a sunflower and turn to the light wherever you are. Oh, exactly, so this was on May 10th. So we went to Jack in the Box, my sister got a lamp. We went shopping, and yeah. I also filmed a journal with me for this, but this is a, another journal with me that I filmed for the Hunger Games, so 
Katniss is my favorite character, if you guys don't know. Wrote some more quotes in here. And then here's, this is towards the end of the journal, so it was kind of more like just random simple spreads, so. I just did a fun little quote. And yeah. And this is another spread that I filmed for Mother's Day. Spent with family, so love and appreciate your mom. And yeah. This is on May 13th. Um, we got Chick-fil-A, and this is, I think, another trip that we took to LA, if I'm correct. Yep, 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 yep. LA trip, best day ever. Okay, these are some random memories. So these are just some tags from Christmas, and then this random flower thing. I don't know why I stuck that in. And then I wanted to study the weather a little bit more, so I just did this fun little spread. And I obviously just stuck in some pictures and did some layering as well. And then here's a continuation of that spread. So I think I did a journal thing for this. No, I didn't. And then don't let the hard days win. Love that quote. And then we had a karaoke night with my brother. So we listened to a lot of music. Stunning singing. Ha. Um. Here's a classic quote, let's have some fun, this beat is sick. And then I filmed a journal thing for this spread, so my journal is getting really full at this point, so I kind of just, yep. This is kind of hard to film because my journal kept on flopping back and forth, so I kind of had to hold my fingers like that. But this was on May 15th, I wrote another quote. Um, okay. This was on May 17th, so we went, to Dollar Tree and I got some stickers. So I got this fun little sticker, these flowers. This is a sticker book that I got from a sticker book that I got. And then, yep, happy thoughts. I think happy thoughts. This was when my mom went to Dee Dee's discounts. So my mom got me some new pants. And then some more random tags from that day. So this was on May 18th, some random memories. And yeah, that brings us to the end of this journal. So goodbye, it was fun working in this journal. I started this May, March 25th once again, put in May 19th. And yeah, that's my journal. Hope you guys enjoyed. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys have a good day and night. I hopefully you guys got some inspiration and got some ideas from this journal because this journal is probably one of my favorite journals, my most creative so far. I love how this journal turned out and I cannot wait to fill this one up. It just makes me so sad how thin it looks. So I can't wait to fill this one up in the next coming months. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys have a good day and night and I'll hope to see you guys in the next one.